My name is Nico. Now you're in trouble. <laughs> Hello comrades, today we're playing Cyberprank 2069. This game has been getting a lot of rave and hype, and I've got the exclusive version. Oh wait, no, this is not Cyberpunk. Never mind. Well, this is Cyberprank 2069. Oh, look at those graphics. Oh man, this is gonna be fun. Let's do it. Okay, so this is the city. And I can see inside my own neck. Excellent. Are you Keon Reeves? Do you talk? What? Pressing the F key turns on YouTube and points it to their own YouTube channel. Good afternoon, Officer Roy. We have a information that a new model of Android is in your area. It is almost indistinguishable from man. You need to find any evidence that find the Android. We isolated the area, blah blah blah. Yes. These graphics. Boy there, laddie. Hello, partner. Did you hear anything about the robot? Don't lie to me, buddy. Who are androids? I'm fed up with you. Hit him. That did nothing. Are you the android? Hello, officer. You have beautiful clothes. All right, I'm hitting on this guy. Talk about movies. Did you watch the movie Terminator? How are you? Then I will hurt you. Ha ha, I was just joking. You should see your face. Android, the first time I hear. It seems to me that you're lying to me. I'm serious, who are androids? Androids are such dudes who are like humans, but they are not humans, do you understand? Do you eat electricity? You lie. I hate you. Hit him. Hello officer, nothing, okay. Whoa, far out man, far out. Hip hop's my life. Tell me honestly, are you an android? Yes, I thought so. What are you doing? I do hip hop. Hip hoop. 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 Okay, that, that, enough of that. There's the android right there, I bet. Ow, chicka, wow, wow. Hip hop. In this dystopian world, everybody's spinning on their heads to forget how poor they are. And all the public transportation is closed off. My life is a tragedy. I used to think my life was a comedy, but now I realize it's a tragedy. Cool story, bro. Hey, look, it's a Blade Runner reference. Huh. What's wrong with you? You're drunk? Me? Of course not. Really? Yep. Okay, I believe you. Ooh, a terminal. Cool. It literally goes to their YouTube page. Are you kidding me? Hey, they're ugly. Intern. Hello, officer. Did you hear anything about the android? Android? The first time I hear. Swear to God. These officers are so incompetent. It seems that you're lying to me. I'm serious, who are androids? You have sly eyes. You're lying again? Take the test to make sure that you're not an android. First questions, are your parents robots? Okay, I believe you. You have beautiful tie. Let's be friends. The weather is good today. Do you like cookies? Talk about movies. Sorry, I don't watch movies. What is your profession? <laughs> I am a police intern. What a lousy job. Ha ha, I was just joking. And I'm stuck in this conversation loop. Oh, I gotta do this whole thing all over again. Are you serious? Wait, no, I, I got out of it. I got out of it. We're good, we're good, we're good, we're good. Okay, um, I'm done with this intern. He's useless. Yes, finally, girls, girls, girls. What? No, it's just some bloke in t pose. This passage is closed. Can you let me through? The captain ordered not to let anybody in. Okay, so there's literally three NPCs that are cops and two NPCs that are just hip-hop heads. A bunch of drunks. Sir, let me talk with the girl Bill is guarding. She may know something about the android. Captain allows me to pass. Okay, come on. T-pose. Hello, officer. Who are you? I am an android. New model. The most perfect at the moment. But I have nothing to do with your assignment. You look like a real woman. It's strange, but it seems I love you. According to the laws of the universe, this meeting could not happen. Ooh, shut down real quick. We will run away. The guard all knock out. Not far from here, there's a garbage chute. It is not guarded. Through it, we'll be out of the cyber ghetto and then we'll leave by the bus away from the city. We will run away right now? Yes, we have nothing to wait. Yes, I did it. I beat the game. I got myself an android girl. So that was, uh, that was ending number one. Let's try out to get a different ending now. Okay, let's speed run this. Hello, partner. You're breathtaking. Just thanks? Some kind of weak gratitude for such a compliment. I don't even know what to say to that. Lord, I've never heard about androids. How can I prove it? 
Tell a joke. Mate, I do not know jokes. What? You're definitely an android. No, mate, I'll have to punish you. Hip hop's my life. Did I mention this game is $10? All right, let's see if we can get a different ending now. What are you doing here? I usually work here, but now the bar is closed. I don't know anything about the android, but in this cyber ghetto, there's a person who can help you. And who is it? They call him Dr. Connors. He was engaged in the creation of androids. Most likely, he knows what the android you're looking for looks like. So we're gonna take the doctor route and talk to that one NPC that I couldn't talk to earlier. And hopefully he will give us a different ending. Who's that creepy looking baby? Is that Buddha? Or the doctor? Do you know the name of the android I'm looking for? Yes, I know, but I think this information will not please you. And who is it? Well, if you insist, I'll tell you who he is. But remember that I warned that our conversation would end in your disappointment. Continue. I say that because I want to protect you. After all, in fact, an android is you. Your whole life is a big, bad prank. I always knew it. Our experiment is complete. Now you need to decide what to do. Your captain does not know about it. You do understand that if you confess to the captain, they will kill you. I really do not want this because you're the most perfect android. What about Rachel? Good thing you asked. You did not think that your meeting with Rachel can be called a real miracle, but officers like you are not supposed to believe in miracles. You and Rachel did fall in love with each other. Both of you were programmed to fall in love with each other. This was the essence of my experiment. Yes, both of you were puppets, but now you're completely free. You two can do whatever you want. The choice is yours. Goodbye, doctor. Okay, so I'm the, I am the uh, android. I solved the case. I, uh, I beat the game. I'm going to go turn myself in to see what that ending would be like. And then I'm going to delete this game. And I'm going to take a long bath and forget about this game ever existing. Did I mention this is $10? How's the work going? I found him. It's me. I'm the same angel you're looking for. What do you say before you take you to the lab and destroy you? Nothing. End of game. Okay. And that's it. That was ending number two. I'm sure there's a bunch of other endings, but I'm definitely not interested in exploring them because this game is lifeless and absurd. And I can't believe people thought that this was actually going to be worth $10 because they need to pay me $10 to play this. But hey... I hope you learned something. I mean, I hope this whet your appetite for summer punk, but I highly doubt it. And uh, this was just a prank, bro. This was just a prank. So I hope you enjoyed this video. Uh, really hope you subscribe and like and yada, yada, yada. You know what? I don't really care. Have a good one. Bye.